In India, you prayed for someone's eye. What happened? Right. I was praying for a young woman, and as I laid my hands on her eyes, where there, uh, or the sockets of her eyes, where there were no eyeballs, as I laid my hands. Uh, uh, by the way, it's <laughs> one thing to pray for someone to get rid of their glasses. It's another level to pray for someone that is blind and has eyeballs. But did you hear what he said? No eyeballs. Go ahead. As I laid my hands upon the sockets of her eyes, literally underneath my fingers as I was praying for her, I could feel eyeballs beginning to form under her eyelids. And it was a, there's no other way to explain it, but it's a supernatural, creative miracle of God. And we've seen these things happen time after time. I've prayed for people that had no muscle in their arm or very little muscle in their arm and muscle begin to come. I mean, these are the things that God is doing in his glory. He's taking nothing and he's making something. He's taking uh, the, what looks so impossible and he's making it supernaturally possible.